Hey, your mum told me you're back here. Yeah, I just thought we could do a little chat. Yeah, it's not going to change anything though, is it? You might stop and think about what might have happened if you hadn't done what you did yesterday. I'm just glad I was there. Yeah, but you won't always be, will you? It scares me to death. Robert, it'd be weird if you weren't scared. But you know what? There's plenty of room at ours for Seb. No, Aaron, that's not what I was suggesting. No, I know you weren't. I am. It makes sense. Aaron, just listen. This way, Rebecca's got every chance of getting herself better with Vic. And she doesn't have to worry about Seb every second, and she just has to worry about herself. I told you how amazing you are. Probably just called me on a good day. I can't ask her to do it. You know, after everything she's been through, after everything she's still going through, it, he'd kill her. Ask what these two have been up to. Go on. Why do I think I don't want to know? They've been at the cricket pavilion, and they weren't playing cricket. They were playing with a bottle of gin. I've been looking everywhere for Aaron. Is he here? He's in the back. You kids. Never cheap cider, is it? Well, I'm glad you find it funny. It's from your very own stash of pricey gin, apparently. What? And they've been blackmailing Daz. I didn't even know what the word blackmail meant at that age. Well, what's going on? What's she done now? Nothing. Well, nothing. Apart from some underage drinking. Yes! <laughs> hey, you're drinking so bad, that's why you were in a pub, isn't Man, it? Now is not a time for you to try and get clever. You're 16. You know what now is a good time for? Cleaning the loos. What, are you joking? Ladies and the gents, just put the sign outside. Hmm. And I think the windows need a good clean, don't they? Because Gabby would like to volunteer for that job. You alright, love? Yeah, those toilets are grim. We need a breather. Well, there's probably nicer ways of sobering up. I'll see you now. Just told you. You won't be the first, and you definitely won't be the last. Yeah, there was supposed to be this party. No and... need, love. I mean, all I know is, it's a long time since I was your age, and it was hard enough then. So it must be even more hard now. But if your family are giving you a hard time, just remember, it's because they love you. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Thanks very much. Bye. There we go. Your first appointment with the neuropsychologist all sorted. Thanks. It's okay. Can't do much damage in 10 seconds. Okay. Yeah, since you last saw me, totally back to normal. You you wanted to talk to us. I can't believe I'm about to say this. Say so what? He's the only thing that matters right now. Seb. Thanks. But I. I don't trust myself with him anymore, and if anything happened to him because of me... Well, I, I, I don't know what... I'm it's... asking you to take him, Robert. Look, um... I know you're upset because of, of what happened and what, what the doctor said. I'm not upset. I'm scared to death. I thought this would be music to your ears, <laughs> Yeah, it really isn't. But if you're sure it's what you want... It's not what I want. It's what I need. 